Derp, 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 derp. My name's Murray. I'm gonna show you how to survive the Texas wilderness. <laughs> Well, the first step in any survival situation is to find water. And the best way to find water is to look up in the sky. As you can see, that cloud is pointing left. As it gets bigger in the left, it'll rain more over there, which means the water is bound to be in that direction. One of the greatest surviving creatures in this area is the white Texas cottontail rabbit. It is able to survive here for up to nine months before dying. So, in this situation, it is not just enough to think like a rabbit, you also have to be the rabbit. <sighs> Mountain spring is the best area. Good thing I always carry a cup of water. <sighs> there we go. And this is how you purify water. The heavier things are left in the bottom. And the best way to also do this, throw in a rock. Keeps the dirt down. That's what I call fresh. The second most important thing in any survival situation is finding food. And if you're in Texas, you're in luck. These are native reed sedless table grapes, or in English, grapes. A survival expert in my class once told me the best way to catch a nice squirrel dinner is with poisonous berries. You just leave them on the tree, like this. The squirrels eat the poison berries, fall to the ground, you come collect the squirrels, and there you go. The third most important thing in any survival situation is shelter. The best way to find shelter around here is to ask the natives. That way. One of the most important other things of surviving here is defending yourself from all the predators. And the best way to do that with a good old-fashioned spear to go out of your house. It just adds character. I think I see something. Let's move in for the kill. Well, it looks like it was just a tree this time. But if that had been a bear, it would have been sorry he came into my territory. Another very important survival lesson is, if a predator comes along that you can't fight, then I guess you're just going to have to hide. Look, a bear! <laughs> Luckily, I think I found my ticket out of here. This old-fashioned transportation system known as the Ryan. Let's take it down the hill and see if we can manage to escape the trouble. Let's see if we can get some speed out of this bad boy. Well, I almost didn't make it out alive, but because of my survival rules, I was able to. And so can you, if you just follow them. Well, my name is James Murray saying good night and good luck. See, that's what happens when you don't follow the rabbit method. You end up hurting yourself.